Robert Blake, an American actor known for his roles in Barretta and in Cold Blood, was accused of murdering his wife, Bonnie Lee Backley, in 2001. On May 4, 2001, Backley was shot and killed while sitting in Blake's car, which was parked outside a restaurant in Studio City, Los Angeles. Blake was accused of orchestrating the murder to rid himself of Backley, whom he allegedly did not love and wanted out of his life. Prosecutors argued that Blake had solicited several people to kill Backley before the incident. In April 2002, Blake was arrested and charged with Backley's murder, along with conspiracy to commit murder. Although Blake faced some consequences, his ordeal was lighter compared to Sue Gay Knight. Sue Gay Knight is a prominent figure in the music industry and co-founder of Death Row Records. He was involved in a high-profile incident leading to accusations of murder. Known for his significant influence in the hip-hop world during the 1990s, particularly with artists like Dr. Dre, Snoop Dogg, and Tupac. On January 29, during the filming of the biographical film Straight Outta Compton, Knight was charged with murder and attempted murder. Due to attempting to kill Terry Carter and Kerr Sloan, Knight drove his truck into both men, killing Carter and injuring Sloan. While Suge Knight met a rough end, Aaron Carter was denied bail and even worse, Hernandez was a talented tight end who played for the New England Patriots. He had a successful career in the NFL, signing a $40 million contract extension in 2012. On June 17, 2013, Hernandez was accused of killing Odin Lloyd, a semi-professional football player who was dating the sister of Hernandez's fiancé. Yeah, this jury of seven women and five men cleared Aaron Hernandez of all eight charges except for one, gun possession. He's going to serve four to five years in state prison on top of the life sentence that he's already serving. 